what is up you guys welcome back to my channel today i want to share some more she modern products uh, that i have and show you how awesome they all are what i did here um i drew these sorry i drew these um hearts by hand and then i put the red glitter in it but what I used was um, this sticky red cherry um, I hand painted with the sticky red cherry and then I put the um, glitter on top of it which it sticks I didn't have to worry about it so as I was painting um, I probably did like half the nail first and then put the glitter on it and then the other half but I don't think you need to worry about it dries pretty slowly very slowly and I guess that would be you know depending on where you live and the temperature and the humidity and the you know the dryness of where you live so yeah anyway so on this one I took the sorry on this one I took the sheer uh, white stamping polish. Now this isn't even a sticky stamping polish, but I used the sheer and I hand painted this. So it's like dripping into this puddle of yumminess. So these all I did was put a smudge free top coat on them. I haven't topped them completely uh, with anything. I thought I would do that with you. Um, so what I'm going to do is do a couple of hearts um, on this nail and just show you. And so I'm going to take the sheer white. Oh, I keep going way off camera. My, it's turned around. I don't know why I did that. So I could have more fun editing. That's why. So shake it up. There's, um, little balls inside. Um, and then I'm just going to put a tiny, tiny bit here on my canvas. Um, a little goes a long way with these, all of them. Uh, so the color that I have on this nail, oh, you would not believe it. I mean, it's gorgeous. Uh, Bell and Argent, I don't know how to say that. It's I'm terrible at that. What we believe and... Um, so pretty this color is gorgeous anyway uh through my ipsy glam bag plus that's where i got that one so this is a maniology uh detail brush we got in our december many me box so i'm just gonna can you even see i'm gonna go this way and just pull it down to a tip and then I'm gonna go here and pull some of this out um, I'm sure you can hear my husband in the background um yes always working okay so There we go. Um, you know, it's hard ish. And then what I'm going to do is um, color it with some. This one is Sparkle Silver Chrome. Jeez, Jill, camera, please. Silver Chrome. Uh, let me just grab this. I don't want to get it all over everything. You don't need very much, so I'm just gonna tap. And since this isn't sticky stamping polish, I am going to just leave it on there. Not gonna brush it off yet. I just um, kind of want it to dry. Boom. I want it to dry um, with a little. Uh, glitter inside. Sorry. So, 
And then maybe we could just put a smaller one like coming off of this tip. Um, sorry. It's so cute. Um, let me see where did it go? Oh, here it is. I'm gonna go over here and just drop a little bit and tap the bottom of the bottle. I've had this for years and I haven't even used that much. So I'm just gonna tap around like that. And again, I'm just gonna let that sit until it dries a little bit and then I'll come back and brush it off. So that's that one. That's how I did this one. Now, this red one, I did use this sticky red cherry, and, um, yeah, on the red, and then I glitter topped it with red. So, I'll do one of these with you, because it'll just be kind of hard for you to see red on red, but, um, I haven't had to um, buff any of the nails. You can get this sticky stamping polish. It sticks. Here, I'm sorry, I was off screen. The red on red is a little hard to see, but in real life, you can see it. I don't know if you can fully see it on the camera. Sorry, I was concentrating. So, let me slide this over here. We'll grab some red. I will finish these up off camera, but I just wanted you to see how easy it is. You can hand paint. I will show you a stencil here in just a second, or a stamping plate, a stencil. You could use stencils too. Um, let's... There we go. This red I have had for, you can't even see how empty it is. <laughs> had it a long time. Now as soon as um, I go to, I'll brush that off as well, but um, you can see some of it. What I wanna do is probably outline them with some really, really thin, 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 thinned out uh, with water, some acrylic paint on a detail brush and then you could go around it and you know outline it that kind of stuff to make it stick out a little further but hey why don't we just grab this one and let's brush it off I use a pretty fluffy it says it's a seven I don't know seven from who but it's a seven seven it's just fluffy and soft so I just want to brush it off really, really easy. Now remember, if there's a spot that you don't think you like very much, like maybe you want more glitter in here, we can always go back to um, this may be dried up by now, but I can always go back and kind of add some more. Remember, this isn't a sticky polish. This was just a a regular stamping polish. So I could go back over that with a little of the silver chrome and see if I could get it just to um, stick a little bit better. But yeah, there you go on that one. All right, so if anybody knows me, you know that I love plates with words on it. So this is one that I use a lot. This is a Born Pretty L055. Words everywhere. So dream without fear, love without limits. Um, check it out. Oops, wrong direction.
Dream without fear, love without limits. I stamped it with the white sticky stamping polish and I used the silver. And look at it, it's so pretty. Now I did put a um, smudge free top coat on top of that. I'm gonna show you a couple other ones that I have. This is off that plate as well. With this, uh, the purple sticky stamping polish. Can you see the keyhole? It looks like a key. It's not, I mean, it's so detailed. You can actually see the roundness of the keyhole. And then I stamped the love. I took it out of something else. And yeah, so those two. This is red on red, and that is purple on purple. And I used the chrome, shimmer purple royal metallic chrome powder right there. And then I went to my Westonia plate. I've never been able to get this image to read. I mean, you can see it, but check this out. You can read it. This is the white sticky stamping polish. You can read all of it, even the smallest words on the side over here. Together, miss you, all of those. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I love this stamping polish. Um, so let me tell you a few things. Some of the products are available on Amazon. Um, just type in keyword She Modern and they'll come up. Um, if you go to She Modern's website and purchase from there, there's uh, several of us ambassadors out. My ambassador code for 10% off at She Modern is Jill10. Jill10. Um, she Modern is amazing. Um, I'm going to be joining uh, Cherie with Just Nailed It on a weekly basis on Saturdays with She Modern Saturday. And there's some big news coming. Um, Cherie has two different giveaways going on. So head over there and tell her I sent you. That would be awesome. Uh, two different giveaways. You have to go to her channel and check them out. I don't want to mess up her, her rules. So, yeah, because I could do that easily. Um, yeah, go over there. Check out Cherie's channel and show her some love. Subscribe and bring people in. Go find out what her giveaway is all about. I think that's all I have to, um, yeah, I think that's all I have for today. So I will leave you. I will finish these up and leave a picture at the end so that you can see how pretty it turned out. And I am going to put a beautiful top coat on top of this to look at that. Dream without fear, love without limits. This stuff is awesome. It's unbelievable. <laughs> All right. Thanks for spending some time with me. Go check out She Modern Products. I will catch you in the next video. Smile at the grumpy. Bye, guys.